You voted for Bush! You voted for Bush! You ought to have a W tattooed on your forehead! This edition of the Riddler Report is brought to you by... We use coins. Dot com. October 18th, 2012. That's how the roads look around New Hampshire when the occupier in chief comes to town. Although it could definitely be worse. We're about three, maybe two blocks away from uh, Veterans Park, where he's going to speak. And if this is anything like the last time I saw him in Manchester, uh, they really didn't block off as much as they could have. <laughs> that was my last one. Do you need you need the whole ticket? Um, you hold on to this part. Just get you in. Yeah. <laughs> Obama volunteers are working the crowd, giving them what they think they need. Turn the camera off? Yeah. Why? Are you gonna hurt me if I don't? No, you're not filming this stuff. I'm not allowed to film? Not this, you're not. So those guys over there, they kind of started to move this way, but then they didn't. I don't really know why. How are you? What's your question? So, uh, right over there, you can see where these people are standing. From there, you'll be able to just probably see Obama. That's the park right there. And not very far away, over here, they're still allowing parking, so it's not like they've blocked off a huge area. Traffic is still being allowed to pass just about 200 yards from where uh, Obama will be. You know, and it, it occurs to me that it may be, you know, five or 10 years from now, we'll look back on this and say, wow, the good old days of 2012 where you could get kind of close to where the president was gonna be. That's what'll happen if things continue to degenerate, but they don't always go in the same direction. Things don't always go in the same direction. The back of another line. My niece! And she's gonna sing the national anthem! And she's so beautiful! <laughs> I don't know, where's the end of the line? Hey, right down that way, you have two people walking that way. Do you have tickets? No, you probably can't get tickets. You need tickets? You want tickets? No. How can you get them? I have tickets here if you want tickets. <laughs> Guy. I didn't know self-employed capitalists like communists. 
Well, you own 50,000. The stores went under. That's what the Republicans gave this country. You ought to be ashamed of yourself. Can I ask you a question? Um, you support Obama, I take it? Yes. Um, does supporting Obama mean that you support his torture of Bradley Manning? I was terrified when Bush took over the economy, and my fears were small compared to what happened. And I'm terrified if this bum takes over. Yeah, but I mean, this guy, Obama, uh, I'm not saying he's... so good. These last four years have been... At least, yeah, pretty good for me, right here. Good. Yeah. How was Bush? You voted for Bush! You voted for Bush! You ought to have a W tattooed on your forehead! You voted for Bush! You voted for Bush! Well, again, my question is, do you support the use of torture against whistleblowers? So, you don't support Obama then? I do support But he didn't he support, didn't he torture Bradley Manning, essentially? Are you familiar with the case? I support Obama. No, I'm not. Go look into it, maybe. What was he, a drug deal? No, he sold the cars. Guitar business is booming in Tennessee. Well, say what you will about him, the president is good at turning out crowds. I'm not sure that's unusual for a president, though. Thank you. How's it going? Yeah, it's all one line. And one line. That's no plan. I still think this one. Now, I can I usually rely this. on people to keep talking after I turn the camera on. <laughs> You're your obviously taxes. not a media hound. So. No, I'm not, I'm not. Thank you. Show us your taxes. <laughs> <laughs> Property, privacy. Any lawyers in the crowd want to argue about it? Have a little debate with the lawyers? Liberty by property. Why the federal government goes after the states. It's changed the marijuana laws and what's the federal government doing? Reversing its decisions on to go after the states for medical marijuana. The right to liberty, the right to property, the right to privacy. <laughs> For memories, right? Uh, yeah, absolutely. And they're going to show you up there. Right? All right, you guys, you're all. I'm Let's get in there. Now, sir, if you're Obama Biden's staff, are you complicit for the torture of Bradley Manning? This is the other side I'm working of the line. Hey, guys, can I please get your. What, what level of culpability do you have for the torture of Bradley Manning? Hey guys, can I please. No, keep this part, please. Is it right to work for a person who tortures people? Okay, you already got the bottom. Thank you, sir. According to Amnesty International, your president tortured Bradley Manning. Do you have a problem with that? Thank you. Bitcoins, bitcoins. I hate everyone who joins for gaining its additional anonymousness, engaging in unregulated busyness. We use coins.com is one place where this wicked people have this wicked fun. I think my head is gone about to explode. Stamped him out before another single person go. Two. We use coins. Dot com.